I get annoyed when people ask me why I care so much about what happens to straight guys and what kind of messages get told to straight guys. I honestly can't believe people ask me that kind of question. Um, I honestly have to say that the people who would ask me that kind of question are kind of selfish in nature. I mean, that, that, that's something that they would be thinking about themselves as far as, you know, I mean, just... I really, really appreciate the fact that so many straight people stand up for gay issues. I appreciate it so much. I appreciate how much you've stood up for me, how much you've supported me, how much you've supported gay people. I think a lot of straight people are very underappreciated. We've come so far in the past 20 years. Amazingly far as far as gay issues. As far as, I mean, 20 years ago, it was a pipe dream, a total pipe dream, the idea that gay people could get married. Pipe dream. And here it's, it's, it's happened in several states. The amount of support from, from straight people has been amazing. So, you know, when someone asks me why do I care so much about what happens to straight guys and what kind of messages get pushed out towards straight guys, I mean, one, I'm a guy. Just because I'm gay doesn't mean that I can't relate with the other things that... that being a guy would be like, and it also doesn't mean that I can't empathize with what guys are going through. You know, I feel really sorry for straight guys. I feel sorry for straight guys and all this shit that you have to deal with because of what you're taught to be in society and what women are taught to be in society and trying to make that work. There's a lot of games that go on, and as a gay man, I don't have to deal with those games. I look at you straight guys and going, damn, that's that sucks. You know, I look at this and I think, man, it, this makes me really glad I'm gay. I've got, there's all, I mean, I couldn't have maybe said that 20 years ago. The amount of support that gay people get now, though, it's just like, wow. It's harder to be a straight guy than a gay guy. That might sound crazy to some people, but I don't know. <laughs> um, and then some people will ask me, why should I care what women think of me if I'm not interested in women? I guess my answer to that is, you know, I say I'm not interested in women. I never know what could happen. I don't know what the future is. I don't know what my mindset will be a year from now. I don't know what my mindset will be two hours from now. I have no idea. I also do care what women think of gay people. What women think of men in general. I know that people are going to have a certain kind of image when they see someone that looks like me. And I accept that and I kind of revel in it. Because I know that when they see me, the person that they see, it, it, it's, it's completely, they've, they will have completely misjudged me. And I'm alright with that. I, that might sound strange. That, that, just, that probably doesn't even make any sense, but it's... It's, it's the fact that the people who have judged me immediately because of this, because of just this whole persona that I push forth, the people who judge me negatively because of that immediately are people I probably wouldn't want to know in the first place. I'm not even sure where I'm going now, um, but... I 
there's an amount of that kind of thing that the straight guys have to do, and yet... How... Where would the balance be between being yourself and being this... this... trying to be this romance novel or something? I don't even know. I mean, that's just, it's just, it just seems just about impossible. You know, it's, it's hard. And then I look at what women have to go through and the, and the kind of stuff they're going through. And that's got to be hard. Um, the fact that people will push forth any sort of aspect of being a woman or being feminine or any of that as being this submissive, inferior kind of thing. A, a degrading thing. For someone to call someone a girl is a degrading thing. Um, we have this thing in our society that women automatically have this less than sort of connotation just out of being a woman. So there's, there's, you know, there's, there's some crap. There's some crap here. Um, I'm not sure where I'm going with this, but I just know that the fact that you all go through this kind of stuff, you go through this on a regular basis, and yet you still give the time to support gay people, I just think you're awesome. I just really want to thank you for your support. Thank you.